Um, and I know the, the article in the paper last week mentioned that uh, you took a four-to-one vote, with Regina, to uh, move on beyond that. But I know personally myself, I still haven't got something in writing or an answer. And I believe that when I received the certified letter and I received the letter in the mail, and I got together, I put all my emails together, and I turned them over to the selectmen, as I believe everybody else did here. And I believe at least we deserve a letter to us advising us, you know, what the outcome is. I mean, it did say in, the, in this article here in the paper, quoted by uh, the attorney for the town, that there was over 50 emails, you know, that expressed opinions, things like this. Well, I can personally say I went through every one of my emails, inside out, backwards and frontwards, and I saw one that actually had an issue that related to all of us as a body. That's all I ever saw. So this quote of having 50 or more, you know, I, I expect an answer for us as a board so we can put it behind us and move on. Because this year, you know, that, that in-house fighting and arguments and stuff, it's got to go away. We have to get along with the slugman. We have to work as a team. Because we're here for one reason. We're here for the citizens of the town, and we're here, you know, for the budget. We're here to make sure that it's like living at home and, you know, having your own budget, right? We have to, you know, turn around and do what's in the best interest of the taxpayers and give them the best bang for a buck. So I've kind of gone off a little bit, but if we could just get something in writing to close that out, we can all move on and put that behind us. I greatly appreciate well, it. Well, if you let me talk to the town manager and town okay. council this week, I'll uh, get back to you. I appreciate that.